Hi, welcome to Test Academy TV. In this video, you will learn how to multiply mixed numbers. Let's start the lesson with this example. 3 and 1 half times 6 and 1 fourth. Okay, how can we multiply mixed numbers? To multiply mixed numbers, change the mixed numbers to improper fractions first. Then, multiply the numerators and multiply also the denominators. Express the answer in lowest term. Use cancellation if possible. Okay, first that we are going to do is to change the mixed numbers to improper fraction by multiplying the denominator and the whole number and adding the numerator to get the new numerator. Okay, let's answer. 2 times 3 equals 6 plus 1 equals 7. Then, copy the denominator 2. Then, do the same in the multiplier. 4 times 6 equals 24 plus 1 equals 25. Copy the denominator 4. Now, let's multiply the numerators and multiply also the denominators. 7 times 25 equals 175. 2 times 4 equals 8. The answer is 175 over 8. It is improper fraction, so we need to simplify it by dividing the numerator by the denominator. If we divide 175 divided by 8, the answer is 21. So it is the whole number. And the remainder is 7. The remainder is the numerator and the denominator is 8. So the answer is 21 and 7 eighths. Next example, 5 and 2 sixths times 3 and 6 eighths. Okay, first step is to change the mixed numbers into improper fractions by multiplying the denominator by the whole number and adding the numerator to get the new numerator. Okay, let's answer. 6 times 5 equals 30 plus 2 equals 32. Copy the denominator, 6. Okay, do the same in the multiplier. 8 times 3 equals 24, plus 6 equals 30. Next, copy the denominator, 8. Next step is to multiply the numerators and multiply the denominators. But in this example, we will use cancellation so that we can multiply the numbers easily. Okay, look at the numerator of the multiplicand and the denominator of the multiplier. What is the GCF of 32 and 8? We will divide them by their GCF. So the GCF of 32 and 8 is 8. Okay, let's divide them. 32 divided by 8 equals 4. 8 divided by 8 equals 1. Okay, next, get the GCF of 6 and 30, and then divide them. The GCF of 6 and 30 is 6. Next, let's cancel them and then divide. 6 divided by 6 equals 1. 30 divided by 6 equals 5. Now, let's multiply the new numerators and the new denominators. Okay, let's multiply now. 4 times 5 equals 20. And then, 1 times 1 equals 1. The answer is 20 over 1. It is improper fraction, so we need to simplify it by dividing the numerator by the denominator. So, if we divide 20 divided by 1, of course, the answer is 20. So, the final answer is 20. Now, try to answer this one. 10 and 1 half times 2 and 2 sevenths. I hope 
you can get the correct answer. You can comment your answer in the comment box below.